the only thing in terms of design, like when it comes to this code and everything, I would try to find something which makes him more special in terms of more, this is the captain, that if they would fight, you can see he is different from all the other guys. So yeah. could be something special for his hat, could be the shape for the hat, could be something that makes him like just that people see, okay, this is the captain of the ship. Um, if it's some sort of crystal or maybe he's known, like think about these old famous pirate captains, Blackbeard, for example, he was known for his brutal tactics. Think about that. What makes your car the, the captain unique? If I would see this, this would be more of a captain for me. Um, mm -hmm. But the thing is, I see also the face here. So this makes me more relative to the character itself. So I can see he has this, he has this, uh, this face for a captain and also with the beard and everything. So he's older, more veteran. He has experience, right? Um, here he has a mask on, I cannot really tell. But that doesn't mean that he cannot have a mask, of course. Yeah. Um, so that also... would be my question, actually. Let's mm -hmm. say in this world, they do need, you know, breathing apparatus or some sort of mask. Uh, if you were designing them, would you first design them without a mask or with a mask? I would whatever de sense in that situation. I would design in with mask, definitely with right mask. away. So I would design, I would basically say like, because I like this face, this is a great face here for the captain. I would basically take this face out here of the sketch, put it aside and say like, okay, this is my captain, this is my captain face here. And then if I would design a mask, I would basically design the mask separately and then make an iteration where the mask would fit him. Yeah. Right, like this maybe, and then show, okay, like when he takes his mask off, this mask off is Ba the mask is basically attached to to this helmet, to this he top helmet part. So he's basically mm -hmm. just doing like, like yeah. try imagining a sound like he's like yeah, just yeah. coming into the Dark room, shoots style. three guys. Yeah, you know, and he's like, and there's like some some air or conductor or something. He's like, and he's like, cool. this. I would definitely do that if they would have mask, absolutely. Because again, if you give this to a 3D guy. Uh, the 3D guy needs to be able to understand this. And I mean, this looks already freaking pretty cool just by putting this mask over that. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> so um, that uh, it's it's already interesting. Um, uh, just be careful with this stuff here with the wires, you know? Mm -hmm. So if, if you go for this savage look, fine. Yeah. Um, just make sure that it looks not too frail because it's not very practical. Jumping around, well, fighting and then having little wires. The industrial designer comes out of me and say, "Lo, oh, this is not form follows function, it's not practical. Um, you have to think like a bit more practical here. So also thinking like maybe the, the helmet is an equivalent of the captain's hat. The captain used to have a captain's hat. So here maybe he has a captain's mask or a captain's helmet. Because when you think about they raid another ship or they, they fight somewhere, they all have masks on, but how do they know where the captain is? How is where is the most important person on the ship to protect? Different from everyone else. And maybe it could be the shape of a typical captain mask, but a captain hat, but it's a mask. Uh, good job, Josh. I'm very happy. Oh, thank you. So um, homework is to, I hope this video was helpful for you. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe. If you also want to get mentored by me, make sure to check out my website, janoschmanesart.zone and apply for the mentorship. Otherwise, see you in the next video. Take care. Ciao, ciao.